afternoon, good every brothers and sisters. It's time I be wherever you're watching in. Bless you in the name of the Father, the Son, of the Holy Spirit. I bring the word of God unto you in such a time like this. Galatians chapter 6, verse 7 through 9 declares, Be not deceived, God cannot be mocked. Whatsoever a man sowed, that it will reap. If you sow to the flesh, you will reap corruption. But if you sow into the spirit, it says you will reap of the spirit everlasting life i pray for you brother and sister i don't know what you have been saying i don't know what is the state of your mind i don't know what the rationale behind the seed that you have been sowing tangible and intangible i don't know the rationale behind it but the spirit of god is leading me to talk to you for whosoever that so sparingly will raise sparingly and whosoever that so abundantly will reap abundantly ecclesiastes chapter 11 declared cast your bread upon many waters he said when the time come he said you will find it i don't know what you have sown i don't know what you are sowing i prophetically declare upon Upon your life because God has lifted up his word above all this name your seed will bring harvest to your life your seeds will bring fruitfulness it will bring harvest peace and starting to comfort into your life in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth to the north south east that way to know and to know that you are so all your labor of blood in the kingdom of God that brother and sister that you have given a cup of cold water because of the name of God in their life I join my faith with your faith and I declare prophetically all your sacrifice will be rewarded Hebrew 11 says whosoever that come to God must believe that God God is he who he said it is a rewarder of those who diligently seek a time whatsoever you have done in the name of God for your brethren brother and sister in this season in this time in this period because there is a time and a season for all that God has created I command the harvest to locate you I command your reward to locate you in the name of Jesus so your harvest will stay he said this is the season of harvest he said but the laborers have been so say, therefore pray to the Lord of heaven. God is a God of heaven. In 1 Corinthians 3, he declared that Apollo saw and I, Paul, what I did, it is God that gives increase. The Lord will multiply and increase. Even the labors of your hand, it will multiply and increase. Your seed, the fruit of your body, the fruit that come out of your life, your children, the fruit of your labor, your investment, your business, a ministry, a career, in your marriage. I don't know what seed you are so concerning whatever issue in your life in this season i pray concerning that sin let heaven open the deals of heaven the race of blessing the shouts of every fall upon your sin let it bring tangible blessing back unto you in the name of jesus christ of nazareth your faith in christ is activated is stronger than before until i come your way don't st stop Give it unto the Lord and give it unto your neighbor. God bless you. Have a wonderful one.